Hello there guys, Philippa10000 here, bringing you a quick pre-video message, and if you'd like to support the channel, make sure to leave a like, comment, or subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And make sure to check out the Game Show Central Discord channel down in the description, where you can hang out with me and my friends. Enjoy the video! <laughs> Going to be okay. We haven't done it. Gotta be supportive. Wrong. Someone claiming to be Henry in Two Forks called a lookout in another sector early this morning and said that I knew what caused the Wapiti Meadow fire. Um. Well, I didn't. So I just got off the horn with that lookout who's wondering what I know, or that I'm an arsonist, or that I'm fucking losing it. Furthermore, I bet you don't have the only tape of us from last night, so someone has evidence to back it up. We need to find out what someone's been keeping in that cave. So we're going to the cave, then. We don't have a lot of time left out here, and if we don't find some fucking answers, when they lift us out of here, it's gonna be in handcuffs. Fuck me. We just, we have to stick together, okay? Keep our story straight. From the first day with those girls to the person breaking in on our conversation, everything. We just, we gotta be honest and consistent. Yeah. Yeah, I suppose you're right. We know we haven't done anything wrong. The only thing I did that could be seen as wrong was chucking the girl's boombox in the lake. That's all I did that could be considered wrong, and they shouldn't have even been out here with the boombox in the first place. So, I'm pretty innocent. I'd like to think. And I've got all that shit in my lookout. They left the clipboards. Henry and Delilah are fucking dumb as fuck. No, I think they're being hey, pretty normal. You... you didn't actually make that call, right? To, to the other lookout? No. It just stuck in my craw. I, I let myself imagine how fucked I would be if you'd been lying to me. But now that I asked, I kind of just wish I hadn't. God, no! Of course I didn't. No way. They're just... They're trying to pit us against each other. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. That's not gonna happen, though. Thanks, Henry. To be fair, Delilah is the one trying to cover their asses. The way I've been playing Henry, I've been trying to keep him as neutral as possible. Or as lawful as possible. Delilah's the one who really wants their ass to be covered, so... Well, in we go. Let's see what we can find, then, shall we? Inside the dark cave. The fuck? The fuck? Why is the door closed? Delilah, someone locked me in the cave. Shit. Is this thing working? Oh, I'm in the cave, Delilah, so she can't. Send someone to the cave, please. I can't get any damn reception. Fuck. All right. Jesus, this is a big cave. Long, steep drop. Loose rock, she's the Pulaski. I'll go for it. Come on. Squeeze through, shafts of light. Could probably get through here. To be fair, Demo, they've been out here for 76, 77 days, isolated on their own. I don't think you can blame them for not acting normal, you know? Because it's not really a normal situation. When you're isolated like that, you could completely just completely change your tune at a moment's notice. We're going to fall down here, aren't we? This is gonna break. This is gonna break. Okay, it didn't break. I thought it would break. It's freezing in here. Oh, stop being a bloody wimp, Henry. God, there's gotta be something around here. There's a way out here we could probably climb up. What's that? Is a shoe? Down there? The fuck is there a shoe down there? Why is there a shoe down there? A 
At least there's a pathway that seems to be leading out. Okay, drop down. Keep searching. Climb up. Come on. Yeah, just a random shoe down there. God, Jesus. Part of the story. I figured as much. Hey, hey, are you there? Yeah, what is it? What did you find? Oh, jeez. Because someone tried to trap me in there. You saw someone? No, someone slammed the gate behind me and then ran away. Where am I? I found another way out, but if I hadn't, Jesus. So you, so you didn't find anything? I'm there. Okay. No, the, there's a spot where someone had sunk an anchor, but the hardware's gone now. <sighs> I don't have any climbing equipment. I just have my ropes. I'm gonna hike back to Two Forks and see if I can find anything that could double as an anchor to use in the spot. Oh, fuck that me. That sound dangerous. Alright, where's the way out? This way? Nope. God damn, definitely not that way. Hmm. What could that shoe be? I guess maybe someone fell down there or something? What is this? Delilah, I just found an outcropping that someone was using as a little fort. I think it's like it a kid's book. Good. Yeah, it's like a little kid's book. It has yeah, to be Brian's. He built himself a real castle. What is this? Backpack retrieval plan. Get boards, rope, rocks, and tools. Oh, cute. Wait. Right, his bag was floating off of a tree. So maybe he was doing this plan and he never got it finished. That would make sense. Okay. I mean, for all we know, it could be the kid who fucking fell down there. I mean, it's just a random shoe. You don't really see shoes there that often. Um, Brian was doing a science fair project about bouncing radio waves off of a meteor shower. Oh. Our kid left his homework? Yeah. He must have been pretty smart, huh? Um, sharper than a lot of the grown up knuckleheads I'm used to, yeah. Yeah. Uh, avoid, avoid second person. It's too, uh, yeah, not smart too conversational for science. <laughs> Wait. Are you seriously feeling threatened by the intelligence of a 12 year old you? Are these your met? own words, Brian? Just saying, Bitch. I'm pretty, uh, you know, with it. I'm a pretty bright bulb. Yeah, Henry, you're a regular Rhodes Scholar. Nice. God damn, he. Artist. It's Freddy. Right, because this was in the height of, like, uh, Freddy. Uh, drop it. He was in the middle of really sprucing up the joint when they left. There's some grade-A dork contraband here. Wizards and you wyverns. I found a, uh, I guess... Let's take a look. ...data sheet for one Gladius Silva, half-elf armor seven. Mm-hmm. Classic wizards and wyverns. Wizards and wyverns. It's a little weird that he just leaves so much of his stuff out here. Well, maybe they were in a hurry when they left. Like I said, he wasn't supposed to be out here. Yeah. Um, this is I... my OC. Please don't steal. They almost got busted. Brian liked to go out on the railing of the tower and wave at the planes that dump water on fires, and... <sighs> I got a call because someone thought a kid was up in two forks. I lied. And just... Said it was Ned. Oh, jeez. They would have been forced to leave, and I don't know. I guess I just felt like I was saving him from whatever shitty life Ned was going to bring him back to. Not that it ended up mattering. Note to a ranger. So, Brian stole his dad's climbing gear, his anchors. That's convenient. Yeah, it is. I think he was going to hide them in a cash box or something and never got around to it. I mean, he Aww. left a note for a ranger to find them and, and send them back to him in Nebraska. Because he hated climbing? Yeah. I mean, it sounds like Ned was pushing him, and pretending to lose his anchors was the easiest way to put a stop to it. <laughs> I hope it worked. God, what an asshole. Yeah. Man, that is the sort of thing that would have caused me to catch a beating growing up. Yeah, well, I wouldn't put it past old Ned. So these are the anchors that we were looking for. Yeah, that was basically D&D, &D, basically. Yeah. A bunch of rocks stacked up. You made a wall and a perimeter. God damn. <sighs> 
You know, maybe he made it because he was afraid of them. <sighs> Whenever I think of Brian oh. possibly going through this crap, I get <sighs> I get sick to my stomach. Yeah. Uh, sorry. He'd hide out here to read comics. The black band, his grief is his enemy's sorrow. Oh. Everyone this guy loves gets killed, so he honors them with a black armband which gives him superpowers. Well, that's fucking dark. Mm -hmm. Dear Mr. Zackler, I'm with my dad in Land of W.Y. It's pretty neat. Dad fished in a spot called Sinks Canyon. Most of Wyoming uh, looks like home in Nebraska. But then there are mountains and woods when you go far. I'm sorry I can't mow your lawn this summer, but I hope you found a good person to do it instead. Can you write back and tell my dad when school starts? Because I don't think he knows. Your friend and neighbor, Brian Goodwin. Aw, bless him. His dad was probably a piece of shit. There's also a postcard here from Brian to, I guess, his I think that's neighbor. everything. What's it say? That he's with his dad and sorry he can't mow his lawn this summer. Oh, gosh. And also he was worried his dad didn't know when school started. I'd say that's a lucky break if I were him. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Ned didn't really seem like a, you know, with it dad. <laughs> Poor thing. Okay, this wasn't the pathway that I found before, is it? No, this is a different area entirely. We're over by the, uh... What do you think is in there? This way. Uh, I don't know what do you th I'm probably going to be killed. Probably something that will kill me. So, you know, just sort of getting myself right with God or whatever there is. Hmm. Henry. And they closed the door when they could have just... Bashed your head in with a rock or chopped you up with a... Yeah. Are you serious with this shit right now? A hatchet. God, are you sure you want to go back in there? Yep. Yeah, especially now that I'm thinking about all the fun ways to be killed. Yep. I'm sorry. Look, at least whoever locked you in doesn't know you've gotten out. Hopefully you find whatever they're hiding in there, and it'll be worth the risk. Well, given they had transcripts of us talking at the camp the other night, they can probably hear us on the radio still now. And probably know that we're talking, and that by extension, I have escaped the cave. Oh, uh, also, oh. those girls turned up. Oh, thank Looks God. Like kill them. Nobody did. Woo! They took some farmer's tractor for a joyride down in Riverton and, uh, landed in jail. Where they belong. <sighs> Dodged a bullet there. Yeah, we've got enough unanswered shit to answer for, I'd say. Mm hmm. I agree. Well, we found our way back to the river. Isn't this the cave here? Yep. Back on through. We have an axe, but Henry is also 39. I don't think he really knows how to use it. Didn't I leave the key in there last time? Oh no, I took the key out. Okay. Lock me in again, you bastard. Alright, wasn't there a thing? Yeah, there was a thing right here that we could use. Come on. In you go. In you go. Down we go. Please don't break. Down we go. The question is, what are we going to find in this place? God damn, this is deep. You would not want to fall down that. That would certainly hurt you. And if you hit your head in the wrong place, it'd kill you. Uh, we've got another half hour, I believe, of the stream. Depends. How close are we to the end for anyone who's watched this? Because if we're close to the end, I may as well stream until we reach it. But it's all dependent on how close we are. Billy, why am I about to be timed out? I don't know. You haven't been requested to be timed out. What's this? Spacebar to drop down. Oh, yes, please. Quite close to the end? Okay, I'll probably be playing it till the end of the, the game then, if that's the case. Hello, 40 Rob. I won't time you out. I will just ban you from the chat altogether if you keep doing that. I think it's a bit... rude. Ah, any slope can be dangerous if you smack your head. Oh my god. It's a fucking body. Oh no. Shit. No. No. Is that the be- oh, oh, is that Brian Goodwin? 
Oh fuck, he's been dead a while. You fell. Your stuff gave out. Oh, poor fucking kid. You're Brian Goodwin. Oh no. God. Poor kid. Oh my god. Fuck. I'm sorry, kid. God, he's been there for a while. Oh, you came in at a good time, Matt. Jesus. Oh, fuck. So all of that was hiding a dead kid. Well, he was here last summer. What I want to know is where his dad is then. Does his dad even know he's dead? Did he just like go missing? Because apparently Ned and Brian left. So where the fuck is Ned? Is Ned the one that's been following us? That sounds pretty fucking likely at this point. Ah, oh, Jesus. Yeah, that's where we were earlier. I'm gonna take a picture of the body. Yeah, maybe it's the dad. Fuck me. Well, we found our way back around. Up we go, I guess. Fuck me. Fuck. It's a dead fucking kid. That's just really sad. It's just really sombered the mood. Someone should donate to lift the mood up. Oh, God. That's really depressing. Oh, Jesus. I wasn't expecting that. I wasn't expecting it. The fuck? Oh, hey. Wow, that looped right back in on itself. Jeez. I guess we head back up to the lookout. Oh, jeez. Well, we're out. Hey, D. There you are. I've been worrying my ass off. You need to call uh, search and rescue. Um, what? Thank you for five bits. It's Brian Goodwin. I think, or made to look like a climbing accident. Mm -hmm. I, I think that's just what it was. I don't it think was probably it was a murder. I don't. Maybe his rope gave out. Whoever locked me in there probably didn't even know about him. I don't know about that, though. What do we do now, D? I mean, are you okay? Oh, because she never said... No. He'd be alive if I told someone he was No, happy. don't, don't I stop don't feeling guilty. Don't. Okay, we cannot play what if games. I... There's 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 nothing to say. Hike back. I think we're leaving tomorrow anyway. Day seventy nine. Jeez. This is so fucked. What do we take? All this stuff we found. You see that plane? Yep. Uh, no, I was just busy packing up. Well, there's gonna be a lot more. The service says this thing is 2% contained. Well, is this the June fire or the site fire? Or... All of it. Well, the two fires merged into one unmitigated disaster. They're renaming it after my lookout. About packed up? Shouldn't we talk for a sec, you know, about things? About what? <sighs> about what happened to Brian. I don't have much to say. I'm 
fine. I'm sad. Yeah. I'm whatever. It just sucks. I keep thinking about him down there, and I just want to get far away from here. What can I do? We just have to wait for the helicopters. Okay. Until then, could you follow that signal? Maybe. What? Holy crap. Yeah. Uh, oh my god. We don't Fuck. know what it is. It could be nothing. Yeah, it could also be whoever was listening to us. Who whoever made the tape. Okay. Yeah. Um look, you should pack up everything you need in case we get the call and you can't come back. I already did. Right, look, if if something happens, I'll remember you. Uh, I was hoping you have a plan. I was you'd have a backup you know? or something. Yeah. Um okay, I'm probably going to move to Canada. Ontario maybe. No, I meant if something happens to me. Right, if you don't find out who made the tape and I have to hit the road. Oh, forget it. Be safe, Henry. Uh, even when we are facing unmitigated disaster and I'm absolutely fucking terrified, Doll either knows exactly how to terrify me and come for me at the same time with her snark. Great. Seems like this is the direction it wants us to take. This way? Yep, I hear you, plane. Loud and clear. Is this where I want to be? Yep, drop down. This way? I guess we need to find a way downwards. Maybe? This could be the right- yeah, this could be the right way. Oh yeah. If it's hot. It is hot here. Wait, this is down by the the first shale, right? Yeah. What's your status? Uh, getting I close. Think getting close. All right. Well, I just got word that they are coming to get us. My place. So I have to head to her place. You sound worried. No, it's it's just. Brian. I'll coordinate with the evac team and let you know when to head towards the tram. Okay. It's north, far, past where you found that cut back in May. There's an emergency tram out there that will let you hike to the rendezvous point at my lookout. I guess I'm going down. Oh, God. Demo, I think there's a bit of a problem, yeah, when it comes to putting out fires in a forest, because, you know, everything is flammable. Literally everything is flammable. I imagine unless you've done the job, it's something that I just don't think we could ever really imagine. Yeah, it seems to be pointing this way somewhere. Is it that climbing wall that I found that time that I couldn't climb? Don't tell me it's going to be that fucking climbing wall. Oh, it is so the climbing wall! 